Hi YouTube, welcome back. Today we're gonna swap out the uh, spinner drive inside this Toshiba satellite with the HP 512 SSD. And go over step by step how you go about doing it. First thing we have to do is clone what's inside this computer so we won't lose it. So it's more on the software side we gotta worry about. Again, um, we've cloned the SSD with everything that's on this hard drive in theory. And so we're going to take this out and swap it with this. Now, I'm probably going to make another episode on how we went about doing that. What I did was, uh, before I open her up, there's some software aspect. You have to either have one of these Sabrent. Uh, USB enclosures that'll take the SATA connect connectors and uh, clone it. I use a software called Micron. Anyway, uh, I'll do another episode on that. I wanted to show you how this is going to work. What the new one looks like, what the old one looks like. So these spinner hard drives are very sensitive to shock, and so you have this big rubber padding thing rounded and doesn't look like it's attached to any screws so uh, we're just gonna pull it back this direction we have to free this block this rubber block from the back to make some room so here we go try to do this one-handed I hope I don't break it All right, so we've removed the rubber gasket protector thing from the old hard drive, and you know I don't think the new one is necessary for the new one, but just to err on the side of caution, we're gonna put it back and reinstall it as is. And again, one final shot. The SSD has been reinstated. It's the old one. New one. 